everyone, welcome back to D's Corner. It is D. Happy New Year. Today we're going to be spilling the tea. And when you're spilling the tea, of course, on this channel, you have to turn that red button gray. Because when you turn that red button gray, you're going to get awesome hot tea. And also hit the notification bell. Follow me on Twitter at D's Corner. Because if we're not talking about it on here, we're going to be talking about it over there. We have Lil TJ. Lil TJ here did not start off somewhat well this year um actually this is day two of 2021 and he was actually right around christmas time he was making a video had a video shoot the cops brooklyn new york cops came and shut it down turns out he was on gun and drug charges after a recent round with police I got you, you know what I mean? And then nothing, I got you right now, okay? I got him. No, I got him. Now. I can see there is people around paparazzi and I guess the people he rode with on a the regular. There was like, I got his phone, I got this, I got that. And I hate that it was in his video shoot because nowadays, you know, people do get arrested. No matter where you are, no matter who you are, no matter what you're doing, no matter how big you got going on, the cops don't care. They're going to come and get you. So, another thing. It's like, we're going to go back to Tory Lane's situation. I mean, he had a video shoot, and it was right around that, around that time frame. Him and me just got, you know, into it about the situation. And then the cops, you know, came and got, you know, them. But um, a lot of people were shocked about this. Even Lala, his boo. Yeah, I know him and Lala in a relationship. Came on and said this. She said, right here waiting for you. And then when you're right here in front of somebody, you used to being with somebody for about a while now, and you usually are with them. And then someone said, that's a solid female, no cap, who hasn't even been locked up for 24 hours yet. If you care about someone, you're right with them. Your mom, aka whoever tweeted that. Um, <laughs> and then they posted the heart emoji and then a prayer, like love emoji. She posted a prayer and love emoji. Is she praying? And this was just yesterday. So is he still in there like and then they said did he get out and then this person said nah i ain't think so so i'm like "Woo, that's not a good way to start the year off you know i hope you know this is a lesson for the dj i hope this is uh because it ain't good <laughs> and then this person said tj got locked up for unlicensed gun and weed possession just crazy like mm. and then he did tweet this uh the week i mean the day i mean i think this was in new year's the day before new year's eve he tweeted this and said steady caught on my phone and then I, I guess he wasn't already in a good mood that day and he was already feeling some type of way but let's just hope that he get out and do good and to put this in the last uh tea spill actually respill sorry but this is what crazy thing about the situation. So, Kima's sister actually gave um, her son a realistic toy gun. Now, remember, we all know that he lost his life, her, his uncle, due to gun violence. Now, a lot of people wasn't really happy with it, and I don't know what she did. But her comment about that, somewhat I condone and I don't condone. This is what she had to say. I heard wearing skirts, playing with Barbie dolls, wearing heels and a child worried about my child playing with a toy gun. But if my child was around here wearing skirts and with dolls, y'all would be saying other sh Man, child business. That's y'all problem. This little boy is running around here wearing So Kayla B is basically saying, you know, if it's a boy wearing a dress, it's I hate. Which, that's the 22 mindset or you know the new era mindset you know we are in 2021 but it really got you know normalized then but i don't condone that air, that little statement you know i just don't i don't condone the statement with the 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 gun and i don't condone the boys you know wearing dresses and stuff like that that's just my beliefs i love people that way but you know who they are but i don't you know accept it in somewhat of a way but you get what i'm saying like just too much i said had something to say i don't like king von's sister she's so shady and miserable to me but do you agree with what she says sometimes i mean i'm not saying 
Okay, so this this girl says, yes, white girl. So she replying to somebody. I couldn't get that reply. But it says, nobody knew about you until he passed. I'm just looking at the post. She just put up about the girl that's supposed to be pregnant by him. She's so weird. So, obviously, it's a lot to it. But DDG just released some new music. We have to talk about DDG because you know that's what we do. Um, Let you in. This is right after the Moonwalk and Calabasas and uh, the remix. He was recently turning up at New Year's, like, in the club, playing music. I think it was Mulan Kyle Bass's. So, hopefully, DDG, you know, get off on a good start, you know, 2021. Nothing too cray-cray. I hope not. But we got some other people in the air. Worked everything out. They're taking it slowly, but they're looking like they're on good terms. They had recently celebrated New Year's together with their friends and um, for the mask it. Anyway, so she having fun and she living her life. They both are. And I guess they really working it out. So, well, that tells you your answer, your update on Kennedy Air. It for today's video. They're going to be more tea. I'm going to upload videos on Saturday. I'm going to do a weekly week spell and also a bit regular like video. So that's my new schedule. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and subscribe and hit that bell. And check out the last video. Bye.